what we should do we should utilize the science and technology and turn the tables over and utilize it for good work today majority of the media is used for work which is not good that's the reason most of the ulama most of the shiuks they say that the media stay away from it and i'm for them i'm not against them i'm for them because most of the thing that comes in your house the satellite channel it makes you go away from islam rather than towards islam and today starts to tell us number one media today is the television media the television satellite media today starts to tell us there are more than 20000 television stations 20000 television stations reaching 5 billion people of the world more than 80% of the human beings are reached why are the television media this is the survey means if you take part in the television media the television media the satellite media is reaching 80% of the world population 5 billion people and the investment in this media is how much 400 billion dollars 400 billion dollars is the investment in this media and people are churning money out of it the majority more than 98% more than 99% is haram haram obscenity misinformation taking away from the truth more than 99% we have to utilize it and turn the tables over imagine 400 billion dollars invested only in the television media christians owning 50 channels 100 channels just making money out of it in america alone there are 1673 television stations out of which 83 are religious channel majority almost all they are christian channels majority throughout the world there are hundreds of christian channels hundreds there are hindu channels there are jain channels how many muslim channels do we have how many in india we have several hindu channels we have in india christian channels in regional language in english we have several channels we have in the regional south indian languages only for a part of india specialized targeting there are hundreds of christian channels number one is the god tv who has heard of the god tv oh mashallah more people know of god tv than many hind god tv was launched about 10 years ago in 1995 by a britisher but it is uplinked from israel do you know at present they are on 15 different satellites reaching more than 200 countries and having a viewership of 275 million people 275 million people is the reach 200 countries 15 satellites they have hired the god channel is one but there was separate god channel for asia separate for europe separate for america separate for india specialization like how the bbc there bbc world is different bbc asia is different bbc europe is different why the 90% the matter is same but they want to even take advantage of the prime time prime time in uk is different than in uae it is different in bombay so according to the prime time they cater the program and they shift the timings so they hire different satellites so god channel is one of the most popular among the christian missionary channels but christian channels there are hundreds of them how many islamic channels do we have i know of many muslim owning many entertainment channels many 5 10 20 many i don't know them you may be knowing they have groups of channels how many islamic channels do we have how many channels we have for dawa the first one that was launched was by qadianis mtva muslim tv ahmadiyya they are muslims muslim tv ahmadiyya and it even comes in uae in dubai muslim tv ahmadiyya normally when you see the channel you think it's a muslim channel the name is also muslim tv but they aren't 
the two mainstream Muslims. They aren't. Alhamdulillah, about eight years back, the first Islamic channel launched was Ikra TV, but mainly it was Arabic. Then we have Majad TV, then we have Fajr. But all these channels, they are basically Arabic channels catering to the Muslim Ummah. They are mainly targeting the Middle East. They are Islamic channels, but you will not call them as Dawa channels. They aren't channels which are propagating Islam to non-Muslims, but mainly catering to the Muslim Ummah. We have other channels which are localized only in Europe. We have other channels which are localized in other parts of the world. What we require is a full-time 24 hours Dawa channel to convey the message of Islam, to remove the misconception what the media is spreading against Islam. I was here a few years back, again on the invitation of the Holy Quran Award Dubai. And that time it came in headlines in the local newspaper, I think it was Khalid Times, the Dr. Zakir Naik calls for an Islamic TV. I had given a lecture in Album. The topic was different, but in the question answer session I said, we Muslims require a full-time satellite Dawa channel and English, which is the international language. We have newspapers which are in local language, only in Urdu. Who reads it? Only the Muslims in India or in Pakistan. We have Arabic newspaper read only by the Arab Muslims. See, this should be there. I'm not saying this is wrong. But what we require is a Dawa newspaper, a Dawa satellite channel. Alhamdulillah, summa alhamdulillah, I always believe in the philosophy that whatever the project is, don't wait if the project is big. See, we are a very small organization. If the project is big, whatever Allah has given you, start with it. If you have a thousand riyals, a thousand dirhams, start with it. Inshallah, you'll get success. So eight years back, we started producing programs for satellite channel. And alhamdulillah, summa alhamdulillah, we are supplying every day for half an hour to two hours to more than six international satellite channels. Six every day. Not only to Muslim channels like Ikra TV, QTV, ARY Digital Islam channel, even to non-Muslim channels, film song channel, ETC, 24 film song haram, at least half an hour there is halal. They see a joker looking person. They see a joker looking person. Who is the joker looking person wearing a coat and a cap and a kufiya and a tie? And somebody is asking a question that why does Islam permit a man to have more than four wives? Ah, abhi maza aenga, now we'll enjoy. And then the reply comes logically and many are convinced. So what we have done, we have always said this is a material free. Don't pay us. Because when we go to that we have spent so many thousands of dollars producing it, the moment we charge, Maximum them issue is once a week. We say take it free. And mashallah, most of them show it daily. Because they're getting it free. We will get a sawab in the akhira. Inshallah. As I mentioned that few years back in album, I had mentioned that there should be Islamic TV, a Dawa channel. Alhamdulillah, summa alhamdulillah, you'll be happy to know that inshallah, inshallah, in the next two to three weeks, we will be launching an Islamic Dawah channel by the name of Peace TV. We don't have the budgets like the Christian missionary. We don't have. We are very small. Small people. Whatever we have, Inshallah. We have called it the Peace TV. So the media is with war with Islam, but we are with peace with humanity. Peace in Arabic, Salam, it also means Islam, and inshallah, it will be a Dawah oriented channel initially reaching Europe, Australia, Africa, Middle East, and Asia. We'll be on Panam Sat 10 initially. Later on, within a few months, we'll even go to USA, inshallah, and very shortly. Within one year, inshallah, we'll try and cover this full globe, inshallah. It will basically be an English satellite channel, but we don't want to lose the time which is not a prime time. What is not prime time in Europe and the English countries, it will be prime time in India and Pakistan. That time we will show programs in Hindi and Urdu. So that we also want to cover 
the non-Muslims of India. So 25% initially will be in Hindi and Urdu. 75% will be in English, inshallah. And I request you to pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that inshallah, with this Peace TV, we'll be able to spread the religion of peace throughout the world, inshallah. We Muslims should basically know how to turn the tables over.